guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to do a quick video for you guys and it's a tip from me to you so it might come useful for you guys but basically when i pick up a book to read i tend to have three days to read a book I chose I have chosen this for myself because if I don't do this I would never get to read a book so every week I go through a new book and this is how I do it I will flip to the back of the book and I will see how many chapters are in the back of the book and then I'll divide that number so say for example it's 36 chapters I divide that number by three because the three days um, counts for Friday, Saturday and Sunday, which are the days that I read my book. And then that will give me a total of 12. So that means 12 chapters for three days that I have to read. And then I will take that 12 and I divide it by four because I plan my day into four little sections of reading chapters. And then it will give me a three. So that, that is how many chapters I should be reading per day. No, sorry, not per day. Three chapters per... Um, I don't know what. But basically, three chapters in the morning, three chapters in the afternoon, three chapters in the evening, and then three chapters before I go to sleep. So that is a total of 12 chapters. Um, I do have a habit of reading a bit more than three chapters. And then I just work out when the next chapter is due so if I have like if I've just read a chapter I'll just carry on reading to the other two chapters so that's six chapters I've read and then I have like nine chapters left so that's how I do it and I get through the book so much easier I've just picked up I picked up a book um, on Friday that I was I'm currently reading and it had 36 chapters in so I divided and I find it so much easier. I'm literally nearly done reading the book now. I have like six more chapters to read, I think. Um, yeah, I have six more chapters to read of the book and then the book's finished. So, that is pretty good for me. Woohoo, go! Um, sorry that I'm moving the camera around a lot. My arms are aching. I did try to film this video on my husband's camera, but it just... It, the whole video, it was a really cool video, but the whole ratio of the video wasn't right. So I decided to film it again with my phone, because my phone's better for me. Anyway guys, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more videos of mine. And I shall see you guys again soon. Bye!